Assalamualaikum and a very good day to all. My name is Farhana Alia. Today, me and my group members will be presenting to you on our business model canvas for our company, Little Lady Scarf. Little Lady Scarf consists of four members which are Afika, myself Farhana, Natasha and Atika. This is our company's vision and mission. Hi, I am Afika Usna and this is our product called Resetai Scarf. It was a multifunction product that can be used as scarf or teleco and attached with Buddha. Next, this is our business model canvas. It contains 9 elements that we highlight in our business. First, customer segment. Our product is targeting a Muslim woman from the age of 13 to 50 years old, which are elder, adult and teenager. Also, children from the age of 7 to 12 years old. We also target a traveller because our product is very useful for outdoor travel or holiday. It is also suitable for those who are perform haji and umrah. Next value proposition, the value that our product delivers to the customer is multifunction product that can be used as scarf or telecom and attached with product. We also added two hidden pocket for storage valuable items. Next, easy to be shaped, the scarf attached the face nearly and in the shape of the wearer face. Next, the fabric is soft quality fabric, ironless, comfortable, cold, no seat proof and light to wear. Hi, I am Nurul Atika. Let's look at Little Lady Scarf channels. We are fully based on our social media such as Facebook page, WhatsApp business and Instagram. We also operate on our website as we don't have any physical store at the time being. Moreover, our product is also at the retail outlet such as at the boutique and department store. Our last channel is the agent and dropship, which they are the marketers that promote our product. More or less, the customer can choose whichever platform for them to reach us. Move on to the next slide. Our customer relations include with the updating activities in our social media from time to time just to keep our customer informed about the promotion, the tutorial and all. Next is the after sales service. Once the customer has received the product that they had bought, we will ask them for their feedback and honest review. We are also giving discounts and other members benefit to our customer that is a membership for our business. The revenue stream for Little Lady Scalps are from sales of the product, the delivery charges as were demanded by postage carriers, as well as from the membership fees. Hi, I'm Farhana and I will explain to you on our key activities which is the ways we deliver our value proposition to our potential customers. We have two key activities which are production and sales and marketing. Production is important for us since the versatile scarf is produced by our own company, while sales and marketing is where we create new copywriting to promote our product. This includes our website and social media like Instagram where we update daily so that potential customers can get more information on our product. Next, we move to the key resources which is the things that helps our business operate smoothly. First, we have our salesperson. This includes our agent and dropship that will also help sell and promote our product. Next is the website developer. They help us in the development as well as improvement of our website. And last but not least is our tailors and designers who plays the biggest role in producing versatile scarf. Hi, my name is Noor Aina Natasha. So for the key partners is the parties that will smoothen our business. As my friend said just now in the previous slide, both of key resources and key partners is reliable so the existence of these parties such as tourist service and fabric supplier will help us in smoothen our business and make it more effective. So let's move to the next slide. Last but not least is the most important building block in business model canvas which the cost structure is how we are planning to spend for development of our business. Cost occurred by operating little ladies curve which are cost of marketing and sales to promote our product to capture the attention of the target market. Second, the cost of material to use manufacture our product and lastly, cost of shipping due to the return and refund from customer that receive the fair product. So this is our cost structure that we conduct for our customer. That's all from us. Thank you.